Hello everyone and welcome back to the Autumn Wing campaign. I'm Keb. And I'm Perry. And we're ready to continue. Here we go. Not. <laughs> there we go. The button is finicky. Oh, the button is partially broken from that stupid pre-Solaris clicking game. Or oh, then was... well, well, you know, I missed that game. What was that about? You didn't miss much. <laughs> By the sounds of it, I missed a lot because people are complaining like hell for, for whatever reason. Well, one, it's an online forum, therefore people are complaining. That's not really... Dying. No, it was a Flash game they had online where you had to basically click as often as you could to... Uh, Try to generate, basically, generate steps towards completion for the whole group. And, um, you needed some, game needed something like 800 million clicks for to be completed. You. So, I, I did 25, 30,000 or so in the few minutes that I played. Ouch. Yeah. Uh, uh, go ahead. And the closest thing I've been to clicking in with that is when Steam had some kind of monster game. Like that a lot. I did it a few, did it just for the hell of it. Basically, I'm a little surprised the stuff that was offered from that wasn't put out as an opening, the day one downloadable for like two bucks. Three. But I don't know. It'll probably show up at some point. Oh, I don't doubt that. And when it does, it'll all be Martin's fault. <laughs> I wanted to. Army's largely recovered. My debt's paid off. Happy, happy, <laughs> happy, George. Happy, you know what? It's better than bad. It's good. Everyone wants a log. Just before we broke for the last session, I closed a couple of windows I had had open. A little morning little drop downs and I'm regretting it now because I liked having a couple of those open. No. Yeah. Welcome to the welcome to the realm of oops. <laughs> to me they're not world altering, it just would have been gonna do something dumb, it would have been nice to have done it in a different fashion. Conquer Tunisia. Now yeah, let's do that one. I wonder when the war of, re war of religion will kick in. What's going Never seen enough for you. Oh, well, until it happens, I can't deal with Austria, and... Oh, damn it. Um? Stupid little Georgia. Georgia decided... Oh, no, no. Oh. Okay, now it's my turn to fall asleep. I do, for some reason, I, For some reason, I... Yeah. For some reason, my brain thought, Hey, they, al my allies are their allies. But, yeah. I just saw the enemy allies and the call allies button the, the balance the other way. So, you're not the only one falling asleep, I think. I'm actually beginning to wonder if you're drunk. Only on life. <laughs> yeah, life and a fifth of vodka. <laughs> hey, Jesus, man. I'm sure I can slur a bit more. Where would the fun be in that? <laughs> I 
Yeah, I have a pretty sizable bank account now. Do doing the accumulate money mission will do that. So now it's time to build another army, maybe. 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 <laughs> Reverse course. Now I could probably. Good lord, these. I'm gonna be able to get away with murder out here. Did everything just fracture up, up into my no, size? I just, I just picked up the humanist idea that gives 30% um, better relations over time. Oh yeah, it's sweet. It's yeah. very sweet. The the top of the the third Ming national idea is thirty percent better relations over time. Oh, <laughs> people are it's like, yeah, I know you came in, burnt down our capital, and killed our royal family, but we we like you. Come back. <laughs> Talk about coming in like a wrecking ball. Let's see, you're still Howard the Mong Yang. As long as you don't do it the Miley Cyrus way. Nowhere to close is a public good, public service. <laughs> uh, hit the stability before I take a legitimacy. You got. Have a couple hundred military points. King dies, and then the comet strikes. Ah, King die! It is an omen! So stability keeps plummeting. This is depressing, but that big triumvirate in Southeast Asia they went ahead and they went ahead and just allied with the three of them. They let go of the smaller ally. So I don't have any easy ability to go and just pick them off. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to do that. My vassal demanded their core back. I figured I'd be nice to them and go with it. Yeah, the League War will be quite spectacular, but I haven't been able to see if... I don't think Poland has taken sides yet. Well, based on what you said, Poland will decide the sides for that one. You're out. Want to play that game, Nepal? We'll play that game. And Great Britain formed. I don't see what's great about it. Well, they do seem to own a good chunk of Mexico at this point. And France is, has taken the Falklands. <laughs> don't tell Kirchner. I have more preparation for me, for me than I realized. Perm now borders Persia. This is a temporary or is it permanent? <laughs> Looks like permanent. Wow. Oh, 
the league war kicked in. I just noticed because I'm suddenly getting bombarded with military access requests. And yet at the same time managed to sound like Mrs. Doubtfire. Oh! Yep, pretty much. Oh, hello, Diri. You do that better than you should. I, I, I approve. <laughs> uh, I, I love that movie. Oh, it was a great I movie. I really do. It is the only movie that my entire family went to see in the cinemas ever. That's that, that's a little weird. Yeah, but yeah, my father was not a guy that went to the cinemas often, to so say the least. My, yeah, my dad took us here pretty much every weekend. And I went and looked up your your League War. My God. Yeah, it's a cute little thing. All the parts inside you are Friesland, British Mexico, Great Britain. Ireland, Siena, Alsace, Hamburg, Bavaria, Würzburg, Mainz, Leaves, Delray, Genoa, Venice, Riga, Lorraine, Bohemia, Hainaut, Aachen, Cologne, Munster, France, Utrecht, and Brandenburg. And they're taking on Aragon, Württemberg, Danzig, Muscovy, Virginia, Sweden, uh, the Knights, Mecklenburg, Styria, Prior, Naples, Milan, Salzburg, Galicia, and Austria. I think that's pretty is... much everyone. <laughs> Not Poland. Poland is neutral. I think they went to war just to prevent them from choosing sides. I don't think Denmark is involved either. No, they're not. They're just fighting huge stacks of rebels. Novogradian and uh, Moscovite separatists running amok. Mock, mock. I should probably see if I can find a missionary. I need an inquisitor, but Inquisition, let's begin. Inquisition, oh, look out soon. Well I do have an inquisitor, but he's only level one. Bonus is independent of all of them. Which is, I'm kind of sad with a level 3, she'll give like. Convert people. I'm just getting a ton of map spread now. Okay. In just Western Ice, you'll have it too. <laughs> Gee, Willikers, mister, I didn't think it was that hard. Anyway. <laughs> okay, I got my vassal back that I was forced to give up. By arms or by words? By words. Okay. Klemken, who are your friends? Morocco. Okay. They won't save you.
Yeah, Ethiopia is slowly becoming fetishist thanks to the Oromo event chain. Yeah. I really wish why did I really wish it didn't trigger for me. <laughs> I know it triggers for all countries after fifteen hundred or so. So Wait, what event chain is this again? Or almost settlers. Well, there are a lot of a lot of quest chains in East Africa. There are those that make the some countries form, like Makuria. Okay. Or yeah. But there's also another event that just starts uh, converting provinces to fetishists. It used to be to animist, I think, but well, they broadened out the new, new religions. The new religions of 1.16 got included in this. But anyway, just what it does basically force converts your provinces. And it d d keeps doing that until about six provinces, I think, are converted and then it stops. I think England has settled the Cape. Looks like it. Looks like a red color. Just started, they're getting 85, plus 85 a year. Well, well, well that ended fast, don't they? Well, there was never going to be any way I could, I could stop them, so I didn't even try. And then I was, there's no economic value for me going down to the Cape with the way the trade network works. Well, I think it's safe to say that the Protestant League will win this one. Protestant League, yeah, well, France and Britain? No, 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 the, I believe Britain is at, uh, yeah, Britain is on the Catholic side, I think. No, no, no they're on the Protestant oh. side. Oh, dear. I remember, okay. I just I remember I just read through the list. Oh, yeah. You think I pay attention to such? <laughs> this is one of those rare moments where you, I'm paying more attention than you are. I'm, I'm scared of this too. <laughs> hey, no guy civil war. Yeah, as if they weren't already in bad shape. Hey, I got a new air, finally. A 132. Right? Couldn't count the order properly. <laughs> He's just not very OCD. <laughs> I'm building temples everywhere, just because I can. Because it's anyway smart. In any way. And I got my favorite idea of them all. Oh. State propaganda. Minus 20% aggressive expansion. It does sound like one you would you would prefer. <laughs> I probably need another general. Um. Oh, they have the uh, gender icon on the leaders as well. Uh, kind of cool. But yeah. they don't have it on. But they don't have it on the advisors. Though there aren't many female advisors, but still. And a political crisis. The game really doesn't want me to have stability. Well, let's be honest here. You are a little on the unstable side.
Herp, herp, herp. So the Stuarts are now ruling France. What? I mentioned that last. I mentioned that last game, last game, but oh. but, uh, but the Stuarts are not in charge of Scotland. The <laughs> Murrays are in charge of Scotland. I hear the big fear was always the French would end up ruling ruling the throne in Scotland, and now it's uh, the Scots are ruling the throne in France. The old alliance reversed. Yeah. yeah. Feel so lied to. That almost sounded like a start of a beatboxing. <laughs> there we go. Something like that. Yeah. I'm just waiting for the. I'm just waiting for it a couple of years down the road. You're to turn on Eurovision, mad yet again that I won't watch it. And you look up there in the nylon stage. Some poor country was fooled into thinking I knew what I was doing. No, you never know. The U.S. might enter it directly. I think that'd probably be unfair. Just giving the U.S. only one entry. We need about fifty. Yeah, well, we, you did send Justin Timberlake, Timberlake this year. Yeah, and you guys sent him back. <laughs> it was a gift, not a loan. Like we keep getting Canada to try to take Bieber back, and they won't. <laughs> Please don't tell. Are you kidding me? What so I, I spent I all that influence trying to uh, hiring a level three inquisitor. And he died. Yeah. Cool. It, 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 it didn't even last a year. <laughs> they don't make them like they used to. Okay, I'll go with the cheap guy instead then. I'll be losing monarch points, but yeah. I'm ahead of time anyway. And Sir Cassia declared independence. Yep. Well, Southern Gothenburg. More countries to conquer for me! Yay! No guy seems to be um, evaporating. Oh yeah. Only at this point they've dropped pretty much all the foreign cores, I think, so now it's just their own rebels left. It's sad. I I only have half the force limit you do. Yeah. I don't, <laughs> well, I'm not exactly filling out that. I'm, I, I'm uh, not even half of it. I think I have 70 troops or so. Yeah. I, I'm near my force limit, and you take me take the idea of a force limit and kick it in the, <laughs> kick it in the teeth. There we. Go. Tunisia. Rebels broke them. Their entire province. Good religious tolerances across the board. Poor Austria. Not a sentiment many in this game ever actually have. For <laughs> Usually, there are two camps: the "oh shit, I'm playing, I'm playing near Austria," and the "oh shit, I'm playing Austria." Uh, 
I mean, it may have three bonuses. Admittedly, Austria can be a very difficult. How do get. You're befriending Moscow? Nope. Enemy of an enemy. Ah. Yeah, that do it. 25 3 diplo points, I'll do it. <laughs> I'm mercenary enough for that. Policies. Hit policy. Um, that one's definite. Um, that one's definite. The Native Assimilation Act and the Liberation Act. And letters of mark, you can just go like a fire. That should mean... I mean, I know what I'm doing. I'm assuming it's actually in the... Uh, not... Oh. Castile dodged a bullet. They were actually part of the Catholic side. But they were not all of the war. I think this Castile is kind of checked out as the game goes. Hey, look, more bullion left the country. Woo hoo! Good <laughs> one I've had of those in rapid succession. Morocco is also allied to Mali. Okay. In that case, I want source dancers. Take Sfax. Language? That's the name of the province. That's the name of the province. Language? <laughs> Take any crappy language like that? Wait, sorry. Yeah, it's much different sounding when I'm awake, apparently. <laughs> Sfax and Kef. Same to you. The <laughs> well, these are, these are the Tunisian provinces. They sound like places named when a drunken Swede was betting each other. Hey Martin, hey Martin, what should we name that problem? <laughs> Call it Yump. <laughs> I really should get tired of that joke, but it's, I just, it's not going to happen. My luck is I'll be at my game developer con next year at San Francisco and I'll bump into him. Like, oh, sorry, excuse me, wait, I saw your picture before. Kill him! <laughs> Which, admittedly, if you're going to get killed, it's... Uh, since we're on that topic of things stopping, oddly okay. enough... Well then, I guess it's time for a short break, and we'll Thanks, folks. see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for, thanks for watching.